Hello everyone, today I'm doing my July favorites. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. So first, I've been loving this lip combination. It's the LOC Lip Pencil and Punch Line. It's right there. And then I've been putting Remon Airy Fairy on top of it. And it's a pretty nice nude color. And that's what I have on my lips right now. And this is the color combination you can get off it. I really do like it. And I am loving it. So if you guys have either of these products, try it out. Because it's so pretty. Next favorite is my Heart Candy Blush in Honeymoon. And it's just a peachy pink color. You can use it as a highlight if you're a little bit darker skin tone than I am. Or you can use it as a blush like I do. It's just so pretty. And it's just like a nice peachy pink color. So I've been loving that. Another favorite of mine is my Beauty Blenders. That It's like a knockoff of them. It's like cosmetic sponges. They are so cool. Um, they look like this. I have a pink one. A darker pink, a orange, a purple, a blue, and one teardrop shape one, which is like purple-ish pink. And I've been loving them. Next, I've been trying all these brushes from Wish. Now, if I can find the link, I'll link it down below. If not, then just search on Wish makeup brushes purple. Um, but they come with six brushes, and I just used them today, so I don't know if I should include them, but I give pretty much tell the first time you use a brush if it's going to be good or not and I do like these so far. So this is one brush. I use this on my outer corner. I don't know if you're supposed to do that but I did and I love how it turned out. Then a eyeliner brush is perfect for small eyes like I do. I have small lid space so it's perfect for me. This brush right here. Which I don't know what you're supposed to do with this. I don't know if it's for concealer or eyeshadow. i never seen brushes like this before so... Then this brush is just for eyeliner, but it's a little big for me, so I'm thinking about what I can do for it. Then I have this brush. I thought it would be perfect to do a straight line of eyeliner, but it didn't turn out with this brush. So, again, got to figure out what I'm going to do with this. I don't know if we can use it for mascara. Maybe. We'll see. We'll see. And this brush, I'm kind of disappointed. It's supposed to be dual one brush, but they did a sponge about Kitter. And then a perfect brush on this end. Like, really? Why can you do a perfect brush on both ends instead of just a sponge tip? But this end works great. I don't want to use this end. I won't break it off, personally. But, yeah. Oh, and if you guys are wondering, I am wearing a shirt. I am wearing a shirt. So, don't worry. Next is a mascara combination I've been loving. It's the Smashbox x rated Mascara. I have on my lashes right now. And then on top of that, I've been putting my L4 Proof Lengthening and Volumizing Mascara. So, I've been loving this combination. If you want good mascara topper to make any mascara or proof, this is one for you. It doesn't do much for your lashes, like volumizing or um, anything like that. But if you have a non -proof, proof mascara like this one, add this to it. It makes it perfect. Next is my face routine. So first of all, I will put on my new moisturizer. This is Balance Me Skin Savers Congested Skin Serum. It calms, balances, and soothes for all skin types. I put this all over my face, and then I use my Sassy and Chic CC Cream, and I put that all over my face. And it's a very pale color. It's the lightest color they have. And it matches me perfectly. Like, look at that. I never find a face product that matches me perfectly. And this just covers everything perfectly. Like, look at that. You came to tell I'm wearing it. I'm wearing it right now. It doesn't give you much coverage, but I don't want that much coverage because I don't need it. And then I put on my Elf Transparent Powder. What else it just? In a transparent color. Can you guys see yourself? Whoa. It's just a transparent powder. And I love it to pieces. 
So I've been loving that. And then I put the blush on, and that's how I do my face. Then I've been loving my flower eyeshadow pencil. And it's in this beige color. I have a purple one too, but I'm loving this one because it's just perfect color. And I put this in my inner corner to brighten up. I put this kind of underneath my eyes like there. I'm not going to do it right now because I don't have a like, mirror, but I love it. So I've been loving putting that right there. Then it is my LA Colors Matte Lip Gloss. This is a deep purple color. This is the thing I wear when I just have mascara and eyeliner on. I put this on and I think it looks fantastic. It's a very deep purple color. I always watch it for you guys. You guys can see it doesn't move at all. So I seriously love it. Why is my nose itching? I think it's really itching. Next is my mo molecular free one molecular water. This stuff, I have one that's open, and this is not the one that's open, but it removes makeup amazingly. Let me get the one that's open. Hold on. So you can see that's on my hand, right? You take this, and you pour some, I normally use a toilet paper, con swab, or whatever you can find. Take, I'm taking some of my finger, and I'm just going to dab it on the makeup. <laughs> And baby wipes can I remove this liquid lip gloss. So let's see. Look at that. It's removing it. Can you believe it? You take a little bit more. And it's almost all gone. That's amazing. So if you have liquid lipsticks that you love, but you don't really like how long they last, and you can never get them off your hands or skin, this is amazing. Remove them. Last favorite is well, last second favorite. Last is second favorite. I don't know. Amika Perk Me Up Dry Shampoo. When I had dark hair, it's worked perfectly. Now when I have light hair, it works perfectly. It's really dries out your hair, you have oily spots. Makes it fluffy and nice. Just amazing. Like look at that. I love it and it smells amazing too. Reminds you a lot of the instant dry shampoo. So if you like that, you probably would like this. Next favorite is something you can't see, but I'm going to use my mirror to show you guys. It's Sims 4. Can you guys see that? Sims 4 right there. I've been playing it. I've been loving it. So I've been playing that when I'm not filming or taking care of kids or doing anything else or doing my hair. I've been loving it. Like awesome. I kind of look blonde hair. I kind of remind myself of a YouTuber. I'll link her video down below. I kind of look like her a little bit. I kind of do. Her hair color matches. Girl, if you're watching this, I kind of look like her twin right now. Kind of do. Kind of. Just say. So, shout out to you, girl. I hope you really enjoyed this video. So, I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Have a wonderful day. Bye.